say definitely go for it. The foundation coaching course has been super supportive. Everyone's been at times nervous, um, but as we're going, our confidence is definitely building and we're all supporting each other and building off each other, which is really good. Fantastic. It's been fantastic from a, I guess I've got the sports science and more the physiology background behind me and I get that quite well with my work as well. But it's also, this coaching course has helped me understand the other element, which is the working with athletes and working with people and, 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 and figuring out the best way to get what works best for each person and bringing everyone together and, and, and getting inside the heads of each athlete to, yeah, as I said, is the purpose of what they're there for and what's going to get them to work as best as possible has been great, yeah, really worthwhile. So the foundation coaching course is, is really exciting because um, it challenges me as an individual to, to try and improve. Um, it's set down some of the really core competencies, I guess, that we want coaches to have these days um, and I know that I have a long way to go in terms of building my technical skills but hopefully from this course I've been able to really set a solid foundation for how I communicate as a coach um, and how I can then translate that into real world experience. Uh, I think probably the thing I've learned most is the important of importance of effective communication being able to get across you know all the knowledge that you have personally as an athlete and a coach and deliver that effectively to to athletes and I think that's definitely the thing I'm most looking forward to developing. The new style that Graham Hill has brought into the foundation coaching course uh, is really enlightening because it, it teaches people to coach, how to interact with athletes, how to do the day-to-day -day coaching, probably the black art a little bit. So it's really groundbreaking along those lines. It's certainly moved away from the old style PowerPoint presentation where you sit there and go through swim, bike, run, and dare I say, an ex-pro comes in and talks about how they trained. That served a purpose, but I think we've evolved as coaches and as an organisation. The fundamental thing with this course is it's really coach-centred. So it's really about helping the coaches develop skills that they're going to need to go out and actually use when they've got a group of athletes they're going to work with. And by coach-centred, what I mean is a lot of uh, traditional courses have been about getting in a room, talking about sets and repetitions for the particular sport that people are involved in. This. Uh, course is really about helping coaches develop skills around communication, group management and also being able to hold a mirror up to themselves to think about uh, where their strengths and weaknesses lie. So the course really relies heavily on a self-reflection component uh, as well as being able to t take that self-reflection, share it with the rest of the group and use that to improve their skills as a coach. To develop uh, grassroots coaching uh, accreditation and that's based around being able to provide coaches with some of the what we call cross-cut skills which are also called soft skills around communication, questioning, engaging with their athletes, understanding their athletes a little bit better so that they can really deliver uh, a service to, to newcomers to triathlon. Information on the uh, Triathlon Australia website under the coaching tab. Uh, so just go under there, look under coach development and you'll see the, the foundation link. Uh, it provides some background information and it'll also give you contact information to contact us at, at the coaching uh, development section in Triathlon Australia.